so this is our broccoli it's pretty short this year so far and there's no no broccoli <laughs> no florets so i'm not sure what's going on with them but hopefully they develop they almost it. look discolored that's like well, a different green so and that one's a different white today so maybe we need to use this water more often because over it's there been 90 for five days straight Yeah, weather update. It's been 90 because it's good to know, you know, if we look back into the video, it's been 90 for like four or five days straight and it hasn't dropped below 70. Mm -hmm. And that's how the broccoli looks like. The straight tomatoes, the beans, right? Peas. Peas. They're dying. Well, they're done. Uh-huh. And then in the middle here, we've got some squash that are still young peas that I tried to plant later and they just haven't worked because they're hi hidden behind these giant beans over here. And then this is the actual tomato section, but all of these ones in the back are stray ones that just kind of came up on their own. The cherry so tomatoes the there. Actually planted. You can show some of the big tomatoes hanging on, but they're just all green, no yellow. Because it's been hot and apparently they don't turn red. I don't hot. know if they will eventually or not. We'll see. Let me give you all the random tomatoes. And over here we've got cabbages, and there's actually some nice heads in there. Like, like that one's a good head. There's a good one in the back. And some more stray tomato plants that are still green. And if we come back here, carefully, carrots, and the hybrid squash zucchini, two plants that came up on their own. Those are almost done. There's like one more hanging on there, and then it'll be done. But I have some new young squash here coming up on the side beside the watermelon and look at all the watermelon. You don't want to water it. It looks yeah. really dry. And here we have some cantaloupe. You can see there's a cantaloupe there. And then there's one in here. And there's some little ones around that I saw too. This is cucumber and pumpkin kind of mixed together. There's a the yellow pumpkin. And then over here's three pumpkin. And yeah, that's what, oh, I see a cucumber. And this is what our cucumbers are looking like. They're pretty much all stubby and weird. 